And tonight, from the gloomy depths of Devil Swamp comes yet another controversy. This time, it's employees working near a toxic waste Superfund site. They claim cleaning up the dump is affecting their health. Environmental reporter Marvin McGraw has their story. It's a real, real strong when the wind's out of south. And Sometimes Gerald the Tillman real, says the smell is so bad he can't even breathe. It'll be strong. You can smell it now. Yeah, yeah. It's a, a fairly light wind, and I promise you, you'll get sick. And get sick is what Gerald Tillman and many other employees who work in the plants which line the Hall Buck Road say happens all too often. Imagine yourself with burning lips and eyes, feeling nauseated, having headaches three and four times a week. Well, that's what many of the workers at these plants say has been happening to them for years. Burning nose, sore throat. Uh, they contacted NPC, what time? Tillman Windows and other time? employees claim it's fumes from the old petroprocessor site across the street, which is getting them sick. Back in the 1970s, tens of thousands of tons of toxic chemicals were illegally dumped here. A company called NPC Services is in the process of cleaning it up. You know, we, we all are afraid, you know. Uh, School Kill employee Huey Roberts claims he and others would like to find new jobs. Nobody want to, you know, want to, you know, cut, them, cut their lives short, you know, uh, you know, be without their family or whatever, you know, but like I say, it's somewhat of a change off, you know, work is hard to find. NPC Services claims it's doing everything possible to protect their workers and others in the area. They've even put air monitors along the fence line of the waste dump to warn them of problems. Still, for some, it's not enough. There's not a man out here that's not scared of getting cancer from this stuff. It's been known to cause tumors, brain tumors in rats, which was already publicized, but uh, we're not rats, we're human beings. Some workers fear even if the fumes are stopped, the damage may have already been done. I'm Arvin McGraw, Channel 2 Eyewitness News Night Desk. There's more to this story. Several of the workers from plants in that area have now filed a lawsuit against NPC services, claiming the cleanup is ruining their health.